I hope at least I can say uh, we, we do bring a, a good team here. We um, have Matthew Boucher, who just finished uh, second in the Tour of Utah last week. Um, Chris Horner, we, had, uh, we have uh, George Bennett here, young kid from New Zealand. He looks pretty promising. He's in pretty good shape. We brought Klöden and Vogelsang for the TT, so, but, but I guess I'm afraid I have to see me for the work. Um, but somebody got to do that, right? We cannot all win. Somebody else has to do the work before that happens. Um, so I think we probably have somebody for each position like of the stages we're going to expect. I mean, we don't expect too many sprint finishers, so that's why we didn't bring a sprinter. Um, some teams brought like a sprinter to two of Utah, which like lasted two days in the race. So <laughs> that was not really like a successful experiment, I suppose. Um, altitude, heat, jet lag, and then, but um, so yeah, we didn't bring a sprinter, but for the rest of it, we should be okay. But I also got to say we, well, I wouldn't say we feel intimidated, but we, with deepest respect, look at the team that BMC puts up here. I mean, just look at this gentleman next to me, former Tour de France winner. Some great talents sitting there in the first line. So it's not only that we are here, there's a whole bunch of great teams and great riders here in this race. A lot of people have asked the R word, retirement. Is it even on the horizon? Sorry? Our retirement. Uh, retirement. Uh, that's not in my vocabulary. Sorry for that's that. That's good. <laughs> well, 